What's up guys, Brett Medlock here, and of course it's the Games of E3 series that I'm doing leading up to E3, talking about the games that I care about the most, and just the games that I can't go without mentioning, like the big hitters. But uh, one of those games that I want to talk about today is actually Bayonetta 3. I'm so excited for this, so let's jump in. So, I'll be completely honest, I've mentioned this in the past, and I just gotta say it again, I hadn't really gotten into Bayonetta until I recently replayed Bayonetta 2 on Switch. Yes, I even played it on Wii U, and I actually didn't finish it, just because at that time I wasn't really feeling it at the moment, but then I got it for review on Switch, and oh my god, I love that game. Bayonetta 2 is seriously probably one of my favorite games of all time. I don't know what I was thinking before, I don't know like like where my brain was, but um, Bayonetta 2 is absolutely amazing. I cannot recommend it enough. If you have a Switch or a Wii U, it's a must play in my opinion. Like seriously, so good from everything. From the presentation, to the zany characters, to the gameplay, the pacing is where it, is the sh where it shines the brightest. It's non-stop fun basically, and they're always mixing things up, and the combat is just so satisfying. Like, uh, But anyway... Today I want to talk about Bayonetta 3, and unfortunately, of course, there's not much known about this title. All we got was a teaser trailer, like a CG trailer, basically like a cutscene pretty much, of Bayonetta fighting against someone, and then he had, she had like her guns that like fell at the end, and then it made like a cool looking 3 that was like a crack. As you're seeing, I'm showing that clip right now, because it's literally all we have on this game. But I assume it's going to be fantastic. I made a video previously talking about how the creator of Bayonetta, I forgot his name, like Hideki Kamea or something like that. Um, sorry, I just butchered that name. He said that with Bayonetta 3, they plan on going bigger and better than ever before, which just blows my mind. Like, how could they go bigger than Bayonetta 2? It's absolutely crazy. You're fighting on top of a freaking jet. Like, what the heck? I feel like I wear this shirt in every video. It just really makes me wonder. It just really makes me wonder what they could possibly do with Bayonetta 3. Like, are we talking some mech battles? Are we talking some vehicles that can get crazy? There's literally not much information to go off of. They revealed the game back at the Game Awards whenever Reggie came on and talked to... Uh, what's his face? Forgot his name, sorry. But um, he was like, we got one more surprise for you after they announced the ports of Bayonetta 1 and 2. They gave us the teaser for Bayonetta 3, and I'm just so hyped. Like... I never thought that I'd be super excited for a Bayonetta game. It, it just seems like over the years, I don't know if I've brought, I've like brought in my Horizons. Uh, speaking of Horizons, like another game that I never thought I would be in love with is the Forza Horizon series. So yeah, it's just really cool that these games are really pulling me in. I took way too long to play them, and I'm just super excited for Bayonetta 3. Like the Switch is absolutely killing it with exclusives already, and they're getting one that we know is probably going to be fantastic. Another one under their belt. Just, the Switch is freaking amazing so far, like, it's everything that I ever wanted a Nintendo platform to be. And I'm not gonna lie, I used to be a huge skeptic of Nintendo, I used to, to kind of bash on them, but it was just coming from a place of love because I wanted them to succeed. So I'm glad they finally are, and I'm super excited for these upcoming games. Of course, this is the Games of E3 series I'm doing on all my channels, Xbox Enthusiast, PlayStation Enthusiast, and of course right here on Nintendo Enthusiast. Be sure to let me know what you're hoping Bayonetta 3 will be like and check out my other videos if you're interested. Sorry there's not much to elaborate on in this video, it's just we literally know nothing but I can't go without talking about it just because I'm so excited about it. But yeah, let me know what games I'm missing in this series and I'll be sure to talk to you guys down in the comments section below. I'm Brett Medlock and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.